Dear students, I welcome you all to this problem solution series in digital electronics. I am solving the problems from the book Digital Design by Maurice Mano and Michael Siletti. So in this video, I am solving the problem number 4.23 from the chapter number 4. The problem is draw the logic diagram of a 2 to 4 line decoder using NOR gates only. That means for in the first case, we have to use only NOR gates to realize a 2 into 4 line decoder. Okay, and in the second case, we have to use NAND gates only, include and enable input, and we have to show also the enable input. Okay, suggest circuit changes to part B that produces active high outputs. Now, let us solve this problem. So, in the normal 2 into 4 decoder, 2 is to 4 decoder, what we have? We have two inputs A and B, and four outputs that is A bar, B bar. A bar B, A B bar and A B. Okay, these are the four outputs. Okay, if we see the internal logic circuit of this 2 into 4 decoder, what we have? We have two inputs. For your better understanding, just I am drawing the conventional 2 into 4, 2 is to 4 decoder. Okay, so A, A here will have a complement and A bar here, B complement and b bar will get here okay so for a bar b bar what we have to do we have to take a line from a bar and b bar multiply with a and get here we'll get a bar b bar similarly second we have a bar b a bar and b okay use a and get here we'll get a bar b so in the third case we have a b bar a b bar okay so here we'll get a b bar okay and finally we have a b so take a line from a take a line from b okay here we'll get a b so this is the this is the circuit diagram of a conventional 2 is to 4 decoder using n gates and not gates okay but in the question what we have to do we have to design this circuit okay that means we have to get these output combinations using nor gates only first and in the second case we have to use nand gates only so let us see the circuit diagram from the first part so here we'll have suppose two inputs a and b okay this is the a line this is b line we'll use here a nor gate okay so sorted input nor gate so these two inputs of the nor gate are sorted okay sorted input nor gate so here we'll get a bar okay similarly here also we'll have sorted input nor gate and here we'll get b bar okay you already know that if we sort the two inputs of a nor gate it will work as an inverter okay so here we have in this line we have a in this line b so here we have a bar and here we have b bar now let us use nor gates and here we'll have an enable input. so for the nor gate case we'll have enable inverted input okay okay here we'll have a nor gate again because we can use only nor gate okay for getting this inverted enable here also we can use a nor gate inverter okay suppose if we have e here okay use a nor gate inverted okay so here we'll get no e, e bar. So in the first case, what we'll do, we'll take the inputs from A and B. Okay. Suppose they let us take the input from A, input from B, okay, and one input from this enable inverted. Okay, so what we'll have because we have here A plus B plus E bar whole complement because it is a nor gate okay if we use de morgan's theorem we'll get it will be a bar b bar and e okay this resembles with the first part next we have to find out a bar b so we have to take a line from a take a line from b bar okay and take a line from e bar use a nor gate okay so what we'll get here a plus b bar plus e bar okay whole bar so using de morgan's theorem what we'll get it will be a bar b e okay so this is nothing but a bar b 
Okay, now let us go to our third part. We have to find out a b bar. We'll take a line from a bar. Okay, so take a line from b and take a line from e bar. Okay, so here we'll get a bar plus b plus e bar whole complement. Okay, so what we'll get after using the Morgan's theorem, we'll get a b bar e. Okay, we have got a b bar. Take a line from a bar, take a line from b bar, and take a line from e, e bar. Okay, so you shall not get, so here we'll get a bar plus b bar plus e bar whole complement. So here we'll get a, b, e. Okay, so these are the four outputs of a 2 into 4 decoder. Okay, that means first part of the problem is complete. Now let us go to our second part. So in the second part, let us draw the circuit. So we'll have two inputs A and B. Okay, this is the A input line. So this is a B input line. And we'll have a E. Okay, use a sorted input NAND gate. Okay, so here we'll get A bar. Use another sorted input NAND gate. Okay, here we'll get B bar. Okay, and here we have E. Now let us realize these functions. A bar, B bar, A bar, B, A, B bar, and A, B. Okay, here you have to see that we have in used here inverted inputs for the nor of nor case, and here we have directly used enable input. Okay, so for the first case, suppose if we have a bar, b bar, and e, and here also we will have to use a NAND gate. Okay, so what we will get a bar, b bar, e. A bar B bar E whole complement. Okay, so if we use here another sorted input NAND gate, so here we'll get A bar B bar E. Okay, so this is the first term. Similarly, we say for the second case, we will have to find out A bar B. Okay, so take a line from A bar, take a line from B, okay, and take a line from E, use a NAND gate, so we'll get here a bar b e okay whole complement so you say a sorted input nand get again so okay okay so he, we have to remove this so for removing this complemented terms or inverted inverter term so we have to use here another sorted input nand get okay so we'll get here a bar b e okay. in the third case what we'll do we'll take a line from a take a line from b bar and take a line from is a NAND gate okay so take a line from E and use a NAND gate so here we'll get A B bar E whole complement okay so use a sorted input NAND gate so you'll get A B bar E okay so this is the third term and for the fourth term directly take a line from A line from B and another connection from E okay use a NAND gate so here we'll get A, B, E, whole complement. Use a sorted input NAND gate here. So here we'll get A, B, E. Okay. So the basic difference is that here we have used the inverted enable input. And here we have used the, the enable input. Okay. So this is the logic circuit of a uh, 2 into 4 line decoder using NAND gates only. Okay, thank you for watching. If you have any question, please put it in the comment section below. Also, like, share and subscribe to my channel. Thank you.